So, can you see this one? This uh, I'm gonna talk about this one. What do you think about the word discipline? What do you think about what you how you gonna react with the word? Do you like or not? Or you don't like the word? Because some some people when they read when they heard about the word discipline, they might think about something that kind of like rule, rule to control everybody, rule to force anybody to do something, not to do something, All right? And some some people might think just yeah, just like the pathway, the guideline of their life. So what do you think about the discipline? The, this word discipline, what do you think about? We, I will discuss uh, today. Um, my topic is, is discipline the punishment? How do you feel about this word? Why do you think it is or it's not? So, so why? Why you feel? Uh, okay, let's next slide so have have you i think some of you might have experience like this uh when you when you are a boy when you are so young like when you do something wrong you do something wrong so your parents can maybe hit you or punish you yeah uh-huh, punish you because they what because what they feel like you're against their rule you disobey them Right? It made you feel. So if you have this experience, so you may feel like discipline is something like punishment. You have to, it forced me to do. It forced me to follow. It forced me not to do. Feel against, right? You feel against the discipline. You feel against. In, uh, like in my, when I was young, when I was young, so some, uh, when they do something wrong, well, so young, when I was a little young, I, I can remember that. When they do something wrong, even though I'm not, um, I was disobey my parents, my grandparents, they always, they always told me that if you don't follow me, if you don't follow me, I'm going to call the police to, to arrest you. It made me so scared, so, so scared not to disobey them. Yeah, I feel like that, not to disobey, disobey them. And what happened to me when when I go outside and I I met with um policeman, I feel very scared to talk to them because I feel like the policeman is can be somebody who will arrest me to jail. <laughs> so that made me feel feel bad about the discipline. But some of them they're against that no discipline is not discipline is not punishment is might be should be something that we can teach to children can teach can foster the children to grow up with the discipline with the optimistic not to against discipline but follow fully fully hard follow the discipline this is another way uh, this argument what do you think about what do you think about so we share and uh, uh, okay we have a pros and cons when i search on the internet search do research for this topic it is very interesting because i found a various interpretation of of discipline okay pros and cons by, by pros i actually i open on the dictionary a lot of dictionaries say the same but i um Put it just put it here just from the Collins dictionary. It said that it is the practice of making people obey rules or standards of behavior and pun- punishing them when they do not they do not follow. Right? This is a kind of rule or law to force people to do or not to do any and uh, on any activity to do or not to do the force and have a punishment to control the people to follow the rule to follow discipline there's a, there's a pro and con but no most people don't think like that the cons in the cons part it say um oh you say that i quote it okay training expected to produce specific character or patterns of behavior especially training that produce moral 
a mental improvement was well, this is kind of a training method. Uh, the second one that is very interesting. Discipline, discipline is not rules. Say, say that they say it not rules or not regulations, nor punishment. It is not compliance, obedience, or enforcement. It is not a rigid, boring, always doing the same thing. So it's not a rule. It's kind of something that. <clears throat> changeable that we can adjust is more flexible not to force everybody to do not to do not certainly force it but can flexible what do you think about this has meaning so <clears throat> let for to be more understand about the, the meaning of discipline uh, for this topic um thinking about the law the law how how the law happened? Actually, the law was written from what from the agreement of the majority of people in any society on what should not do, what shouldn't happen to our society, right? They not to do that one, not to do that one, not to do anything, and put punishment that is for the people who are against the law, who are against the law. You have to go in jail. You have to pay. Uh, Common said you have to pay it fine, right? This this is the law. How the law works, but and because it comes from agreement of majority. But do you think? Do you totally agree with the law in your society? No, some you might not agree agree with the law in your country. You might feel a little against. I don't. I'm I'm I'm, I'm disagree with the law, but. To, how to do? I cannot. I, I cannot break the law because I I break the law. What I happened to me? I will. I have to go to jail, right? So, but you act, have against in your mind. You disagree and you feel like sometimes the law is out of date. It should be changed. It should be adjusted, right? So this is the meaning of the law. Say, I compare it to show you the meaning of uh, discipline because it's. In some sense, discipline relates to rule, obligation, and law. So you feel against the law. What do you do if you feel like this law is not effective anymore? Change it, right? We can change. We can adjust and find the majority how they say, and then rewrite the law again. So discipline could be, could 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 be at the same function of the law. Uh -huh. This is a compared to the law and how, as from my research, how people think about discipline. That's just from my research. You might not agree with me. Rough research for this uh, topic. So, from from the comparing to the law, from various meaning of discipline. What do you think? What discipline should be? Should be the strictly rule or something flexible? I as I do research from, uh, from the internet, uh, they found that in some place they realize they understand the discipline in very various in very in many many meanings. I have been in in the United States in the United States for eight years, and I found that some sense of American people they they talk they they refer to the the law right. You if you do this, you against the law. The law will control you to go into jail. Everything rely on the law. It probably because of American how you can find the real American people. No, because it consists of Asian. Um, African American, Latin American from Europe, from many many places, they live together from various culture. So, we American use the law to be like uh, the central line, the the center to control people to live together. So we, it's, this is a basic idea of the American law. You have to follow on that, and then 
discrimination was is very uh, important topic. If you against if you discriminate is against the law, right? The, the idea of the law right now. If you discriminate, you against the you against the law. But what happened right now? What happened? There's there's still some case that you feel like the the discriminate still happened in the United States. So it means, basically, I mean, if you compare the discipline, discipline is a law against the discrimination. But sometimes it still happen. It still happen. So we have to use the discipline or the law to control, not control that discriminate should not happen. If anybody discriminate, you have to be punishment, right? In the in the case of um, color people, <laughs> black students are punished more harshly and more frequently than white students for the same offense. This for just uh, only example. But from Japan, from Japan, how do people realize this plane? From Japan, okay, do you see the pictures? In the school, before the children get here, getting into the room, they have to put like shoes, put back in order, in organized, well organized in order. It what it how what happened because the parents parents in the parents in Japan they force uh, they teach the discipline to their children from they teach from the young uh, they teach it and so the discipline is something in the mind of the Japanese people. We don't have to force them. We don't have to say them to do, not to do. They would put it in order. They would have, they have discipline automatically. They have, in, they have in their mind, in their daily life, we don't have to, um, to talk to them or point them, to force them, to guideline them to, hey, you should have discipline. You have to do in order or not because they, in their lifetime, Everything is in order and well organized. We have the discipline. In the Buddhist society, do you have not? Yes. It's some, for example, we, in the Buddhism, oh, sorry for my slide. In Buddhism society, huh, discipline relates with precept. Precept. Mm -hmm. Precept should guide you not to do, not to again. If you again, okay, you the law of karma will affect to you. You you did a bad karma. If you against the precept, like this is a, for the basic one, five precepts: not killing, not stealing, no to sexual misconduct, no lies or harsh words, and not relate with intoxicant. This is a basic. Basic discipline or precept of the Buddhist to control Buddhist people to act, uh, to do, to follow, to do the good thing, not to relate with the bad thing. Okay, and last one. So in the modern right now we i found some some way of inter interpret discipline we go if you search on the motiv motivation quote we have to say self discipline self control so it means a discipline is the guideline to improve your life improve your your attitude to improve your uh, improve your lifestyle like you have to have self control, you have to balance yourself, calmness, determination, you like have confidence, willpower. So there's a lot, a lot, a lot of step to, to, to develop your discipline to gain the better life. So, um, this is my point. So, at the end, so. What I can say, 
discipline. It how you see discipline, how you realize discipline relates to your attitude, or maybe your past experience too. If you love to improve yourself, discipline will be the guideline, good guideline. But if not, you will feel like it is a strictly obligation. However, it is changeable. So you can change your meaning. In this context, you feel discipline is something so strictly. In this context of discipline, it, it's my life guidance. So, how? What do you think about it? So this is my question for sharing. Thank you for wisdom talk today.